You're watching the Cowboys Report. I am Tom Downey. Post-game mailbag. I mean, not quite sober, but we'll break it down. All your questions coming in. Hashtag Cowboys or Super Chat. CJ DeYoung III. If we run the table and we have the same record as the Eagles, who is the higher seed? Happy things to Thanks for everything. Cheers to you, CJ. I appreciate that. Um, I think if you run the table... You would win, and I, I gotta double check this, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. You would win the NFC division tiebreaker. So if you run the table and the Eagles lose another game, you will get the number, the NFC East seed, and what might end up being the number one seed come postseason. Nova Legion, CD caught that touchdown. Screw the NFL, DC for L. You can always type in uh, hashtag F the refs because they suck. In that case, though, I do think that I do think it was the right call. I, I and I gotta double check it again. I'm not that sober. If the if the foot is in and the heel is out, incomplete. But unreal catch by Lamb, who was very damn good in today's game. All right, gaming with Waters. That was a sloppy game, but at least one hopefully got Odell Beckham. Look, this was dubbed by me and many of you watching as the OB as the Beckham Bowl. He will visit Monday, December fifth. And if you're Jerry, you probably you you want to get the medical info and not let him get out of the building. In theory, ISO times Liger, which is of course a lion tiger hybrid. Think we'll sign OBJ tonight? No. Uh, I think early December he'll sign, and in theory, you'll then get him in the, in the building, get him to speed, get him with the offense, and make him a very talented one-two-three punch of Lamb, Gallup, OBJ in no particular order. What do you think then? Is the percent chance the Cowboys end up signing OBJ? I would monitor the. Cowboys, Giants, and Bills as your big three. Ravens, Chiefs, Niners kind of lurking there in the background. Percent chance, then, the Cowboys sign OBJ. It's the pinned comment on today's show. If the ad break comes here, take advantage of it. Let me know in the comment section. From Brokov, imagine how good we'd be if we had a consistent play card and coach who knew how to discipline his team. The big complaints I think you have are inconsistent play calling, penalties, and like you had all of those issues show up today, and you won by eight with a backdoor cover. I'm okay with that, but come playoff time, that has to get figured out. Hopefully, it does. Now, today's Cowboys report is made possible by Established Titles. They sponsor today's show, and Established Titles is a fun and novel way to preserve the natural woodlands of Scotland while helping global reforestation efforts. It's a project based on the historic Scottish custom of where landlords are referred to as lairds or lords and ladies in English. Title packs give at least one square foot of dedicated land with a unique plot number and a private estate in Edelston, Scotland, and a certificate, official one, by the way, with a crest. The first 200 people who get a thought pack using my link will effectively be next to my pub within a few minutes or so of walking distance. Depending on how many of you want to become a lord or a lady, we can build our own little Cowboys Report kingdom. It makes an amazing last-minute gift and establish that I was actually running a massive early Black Friday sale right now. With discounts up to 80% off. Plus, if you use code CHAT, C-H-A-T, you get an additional 10% off. Go to EstablishedTitles.com slash chat and get your gifts now to help support the channel. EstablishedTitles.com slash chat. From Mook and Cowboys, is Zeke back or do we pay TP next year and give Zeke way less money? Zeke was, I want to make it clear, Awesome today. 5.8 yards per carry, 92 yards a score. Awesome production. What you have to look at here is the overall season. He's still averaging not nearly as good as Pollard. 
So I don't think Zeke comes back at his current contract. He is in the Amari Cooper, Lyle Collins, Tank Lawrence situation from last year where they can cut him. No one wants to trade for him, by the way. Or maybe a restructured deal and give Zeke less money and try to pay Tony Pollard at that point. Luis Martinez Vidal. I think the Cowboys are looking for a, a corner two after this season. Yes. Kelvin Joseph has been up and down at best on defense. He, of course, missed uh, today's game against the Giants on Thanksgiving with an illness. But Anthony Brown has been, to be blunt, bad. He was, I thought he was really good last year. Not good this year. Maybe bounces back down the stretch. But, yeah, I think cornerback two is a significant area of concern. Iso times Liger. Odell posted another Twitter post. Hints after hints, he loves the attention. He does. We said this on one of our videos, the many we've done on OBJ. Odell Beckham wants to feel the love. He wants to be told, ah, I see. we need you, Odell. We got to get you in here. We need you to have, you know, we got to make that push. He wants to feel the love. As long as it's not a locker room issue, it's recruiting. It's college football recruiting. The kids want to feel the love. I'm fine with that. We will have more Odell back in coverage for you right here on the Cowboys Report. Free videos every single day when you guys subscribe. YouTube.com slash at Cowboys TV. The Lunatic is a number one need to give a quick and easy touchdown after the game. They do. It sucks, but they do. You know, if you look at like any advanced metric, the Bills would be near the top of, of defense. And you might have watched the Bills game. They allowed the score against the Lions. And then, they, of course, Josh Allen went Josh Allen mode. So it's not great. But hey, when you allow 20 points per game overall, you should win. I know you the, the, the not covering sucks, but the Giants took up a minute of game time. And that included, by the way, and this is what the real problem is, two penalties on that drive. Most impactfully, a 14-yard one on everyone's favorite, correctly so, player, Micah Parsons. Cut out the mistakes, the flags, and it is a much better result score-wise over the Giants. From Vince, the Giants have a reduction for OBJ. Niners make much more sense. I think the Niners are better than the Giants. But the Giants' number two receiver today, from a snap count perspective, was Isaiah Hodgins, who was cut by the Bills this year. From a need perspective... Nobody makes more sense than the Giants. Now, he was three cuts, 31 yards. Richie James, Darius Slayton, they need, they need a receiver. Now, there's also the familiarity there. Impact-wise, like being a good team, not so much. But knowing the Giants as OBJ does and their need, I think it does make sense. But you won the Beckham Bowl, so it's awesome. All right, the Cowboys now sit at 8-3. and three. They are fighting hard for a playoff spot and still the division crown. What is your confidence level in the Cowboys for the rest of the year? Scale it from 1 to 10. Sam Jordan, Lamb is better than Amari Cooper. You know, Amari's still doing his whole disappear in road games thing. My issue was never making Lamb wide receiver 1. It's you wanted three good receivers because, you know, why wouldn't you? And... You know, Lamb replaces Cooper or vice versa, whatever. And Gallup steps into wide receiver two. And no other receivers caught passes today. You're missing that wide receiver three. That is why you're in the market for Odell Beckham. From Brokov, how likely is it that Keyshawn Boutte falls to you in round two? Would you take him? Round two? Let's ride. Up and down player, inconsistent, some concerns, I know. But yeah, I would take him in round two. I'm not going to pretend that I know he'll be there in round two. It is November. We'll see. Maybe he does. Maybe he doesn't. I would be surprised uh, in the end uh, in terms of where Boutte ends up going. If he's there in round two, I'm, I'm all for it, but I'm going to go up there. 
If your questions were not answered on today's live edition of the Cowboys Report, hit me up on Twitter at WhatGoingDowny. My DMs are open for that exact reason. Slide on in and let me know at WhatGoingDowny.